It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray at the microphone and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And we're ready to bring you the second leg of this UEFA Champions League semi-final. It's Real Madrid against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, PSG deserved their win in the first leg, but this is going to be a really tight battle today. Let's just hope it's a good game and full of attacking quality. Starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Toni Kroos plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the main goal scoring threat provided today by Karim Benzema. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And up front, one of the best the game has ever seen, Lionel Messi. And they get the ball rolling in the second leg of this Champions League semi-final. The commitment to attack is there for all to see. Verratti this time. Mbappe into the middle. And in fact a good but straightforward claim by the keeper. Playing with purpose and control. And he takes on the shot. And a goal to open the scoring. A very bright start to this one. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Overall, in this tie, it is 2-2. Couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw-in to come. Tony Kors. Vinicius. Vinicius! That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. Delivering it. 
And the keeper won't be complaining about that corner kick delivery. His ball all the way. Di Maria. Lionel Messi. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, he's had his name taken by the referee. Well, he knew he was going to get booked. It's a poor tackle, really. Ramos. Chance to run at them. Options in the centre. And the keeper there to catch it under no real pressure. Benzema seducing with his passing. Well cleared away. Played over. No keeper will mind that sort of corner. Di Maria. It should be. Terrific piece of anticipation. Benzema. Excellent vision. Pause. And cross, but nobody in the vicinity. Throw in here for PSG. Van that on to Messi. He's in behind. Still possibilities. Marvellous anticipation. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And the counter-attack came to nothing. Di Maria. Now with Hakimi. Another sitting ever deeper. Messi. Good movement. Mbappe. Could be. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Casemiro. Room to roam for the Merengues here. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. And they're underway in the second half of this Champions League semi-final second leg. Modric. Now Casemiro. Tony Kroos is with Vinicius Junior using all his defensive acumen to cut it out no foul, PSG advantage Idrissa Gay making use of his physical strength to hang on to it firing it in oh the keeper made it look routine it was anything but Mendy. Now Casemiro. Modric. Ian. 
Idrissa Gay. And the keeper has possession of it. Hakimi. But they dealt with the threat posed. 30 minutes, and he's in. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Plenty of goals if you look at the aggregate. 3-2 here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. PSG with work to do. Corner coming up. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. And a short corner, let's see. He cuts it back. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. The ball with Luka Modric. Given away by Real Madrid. Mbappe. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Herrera. And that's a corner. Substitution for Real Madrid. Played over, and well, the keeper won't be complaining about that corner kick delivery. His ball all the way. Messi takes the shot, and he read it really well. Fine save. Well, they fancy a short one. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. The 
keeper going in the right direction and saving it. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? Taken short. Forced into the penalty area. Messi. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Danilo Pereira. Here's Mbappe. Timely intervention. Modric. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, will that come back to haunt them? A golden chance miss. Well, the game should be over. How's he missed that? Substitution it is for PSG. Verratti and the referee is going to add on four added minutes and he takes on the shot superb block Carvajal so the home fans are thrilled because they can now book their tickets for the final. Well, Derek, that was a tough game. They had to work really hard to edge it. Credit to them, though, they didn't have it all their own way, but they showed a lot of character and resilience, which will hold them in good stead going forward into the next round. And one man who's been terrific up to this point, Karim Benzema. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today, 